only about Gaza today. It's about the crimes that we are facing here every day, about the checkpoints, the humiliating checkpoints. Uh, they are doing uh, crim crimes every day. They are condemning our children, burning them alive. They are stalling our land every day. This is a manifestation actually of uh, uh, the will of the people to fight against the occupation and the right also to reach Jerusalem and especially in this uh, night which is very sacred for uh, the Muslim faith and uh, it is uh, only the right of the Palestinians to go into their sacred city that the right that is denied by the Israelis and this is why we see that uh, there are thousands of people, tens of thousands actually, that are flocking into uh, this point where the entrance of Jerusalem is. This could be the beginning of the Third Intifada if the Israelis continue their aggression against Gaza and if they continue also disregarding the uh, rights and the aspiration of the Palestinian people and uh, sabotaging all efforts to reach a political solution that will uh, guarantee the right of the Palestinians to independence. I want to say it's a shame on the international community who are watching and supporting old Israeli murders and massacres and offensive attacks on civilians in Gaza and today here in, in Jerusalem, in Qalandia.